Hello everybody, SCP Slayer here, and welcome to a brand new uh, mod that I found. Uh, so yeah, I was looking for like horror mods because, you know, it's spooky month. And uh, I thought, you know, I wonder if there's any ARG mods, like, uh, like what was the name of it? In Your World, that, that really good uh, horror mod. Uh, and I stumbled upon something else the creator had made on his channel. Uh, I forgot to uninstall journey maps, though, it seems. <laughs> the I don't think that's really a hindrance. I'm pretty sure it's more of a bonus for me, maybe? Maybe it'll help me find structures, because apparently this mod has structures and stuff in it. Um, but yeah, apparently this is straight up the brand new uh, ARG mod that the developer, has, the, the developer of In Your World has been making. Uh, if you don't know what In Your World is, it's a really, really, like, popular uh, ARG-style horror mod. With a good few twists in it. It's like classic ARG. I'm very tempted to, like, grab a classic-style texture pack for this, in all honesty. Because uh, that might look kind of cool. Uh, and I'm also very tempted to turn off the shaders. But, for now, we're gonna play with the shaders on. If it feels like it starts to clash with it, uh, we will turn it off. I'm mainly playing with the shaders on because, uh, some of the videos seemed to have shaders. I couldn't fucking tell. Uh, but I swear I saw some shadows, so I think there was some? Either that or that was just a weird lighting effect. And I'm just crazy. Uh... Maybe I should turn off the shaders. I'm not sure. For now, we'll play with them on. But, uh... Yeah, apparently this one's... Very difficult to figure out... If it's even working. Because from what I have seen of it... And I've seen one person play it. Uh, so far. And they didn't, I didn't really pay attention to what they were doing. I just saw some weird, creepy things that could happen. Uh... It seems that this one relies a lot on exploration and stuff, so I'm just gonna guess that we have to find some structures or something. God, what in the world is this generation? <laughs> I have never gotten a cliff like this to generate. What the hell? It's like perfect... Perfectly sloped on all sides, what the hell? This is just normal Minecraft parts, too. Anything weird looking over there? Didn't look like it. But yeah, I guess for now, we will see what we can find. Maybe find a spot to build some form of a base. For now. I'm not sure how much of that video was correct and how much of it was the YouTuber trying to spice things up. But uh, we'll find out. <laughs> we'll find out. It's definitely supposed to have a classic ARG vibe to it, though. Oh, coal. Hell yes. Need that. Okay, crafting table right away. Sticks. Pickaxe. Let's get some coal. What the fuck was that? I, I just heard a door open somewhere. There's no doors near me. Unless there's somehow... There's a doorman place nearby? No? What the hell was that? Okay. I guess that's just how that's gonna work then.
It's also very tempting to, like... Actually, hold on. It's very tempting to turn on... We're, we're gonna... We're gonna bring the textures back a little bit. Hold on. Your classic Minecraft. Oh yeah, that that's older. That's the older textures. That's the classic stuff. I don't think the leaves have changed much, but the the stone and the grass and stuff. And oh my god, the cobblestone texture. Oh my god, I haven't seen this in so long. I haven't played on the older versions in a while. Oh my god, I always forget that this texture pack is actually just built into the into the game. I don't know what that sound was. But something is definitely there. Something be creeping on us. So, standard horror. Anyway. Uh, let's make stone pickaxe. Stone sword. And a stone axe. Why the hell not? There's probably not going to be very many edits, because I don't want to, like, miss something, and then you guys not be able to catch it, because I fucking edited that part out. So yeah, don't expect that many edits. Because uh, I want you guys to be able to catch anything that is missed. I'm also going to up the volume for you guys now that I think about it. So now you guys will get the full volume of the game. Actually, I'm going to bring the volume down just a little, though. Just so it's not overpowering me. It's going to be a, like a balancing act. I'll get the rest of that tree later. For now, I think we uh, put ourselves up in this cave for now. I think this will work. Ow. I don't know why I jumped there. I was dumb. That was a dumb decision. I don't know why the hell I made it. So, yeah. Did I hear double digging, or was that just weird sound effect? I am not sure. But I am going to dig in here. And I am going to... Give myself a little... I heard something. I hear it. Is there something here? I wish I don't I don't think I saw any sheep, so which is a little annoying. I would like to be able to pass the night. But at the same time, I guess passing the night would be a bad idea, wouldn't it? In a horror thing. Maybe I go in here? I don't know. I don't see a single animal, actually. Wait. I don't think I saw any back in the field, either. Did I? I don't remember. No, there weren't any animals. Wait. Where are the animals? I am very unsure. Uh, where are I gonna go in here? And we're gonna... No, no. We'll make it a classic door. This should have the classic texture, which means... What the fuck was that? Oh yeah, classic door. I thought for sure. I thought for sure it'd open the damn door. I don't know what the fuck that thing is. What the fuck it wants, but... I wouldn't be surprised if we could open doors.
Okay, we're gonna we're gonna do the classic Minecraft stuff. The things everyone does, and yet are so fundamentally old that they're basically just classic. <laughs> I hear a zombie. There's a cave. Or there's more of a cave. Well, of course there is. I've already seen that there's more of a cave. Though I'm not sure how close we are to the rest of the cave. Nope. There goes that. Gex. I don't have any food. I haven't found a village or anything. It's already night. Ah, I was wondering if there would be a cave down here. Thank you, Creeper, for blowing up the other Creeper. Die, spider. That zombie not drop any flesh, I just realized. Shit, I could've used that. Would've sucked, but I could've used it at least. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put a door right here. So that mobs can't get in. And then I'm gonna expand my hole a bit. Which sounds weird not saying it out loud. But we're gonna put a furnace there. For when we get some stuff to cook. You wanna run that sound by me again? What the fuck was that? <laughs> one of these one of these fucking times that door's gonna be open when I hear that sound. Let you know, put the door in there well. Alright. Let's go. What is that sound? I don't know that sound. That does not sound familiar. That's skeleton, that's skeleton, that's skeleton. Retreat, retreat, retreat. <laughs> Fall back. <laughs> the door. Hey, asshole. Got you. Alright, now I need this zombie. Hi, zombie. Not the skeleton. Wanted, which was just some rotten flesh. Oh, cool! I got like the percent chance of it not giving you hunger. God, I swear, my luck. The amount of times I've gotten that on like the first thing I eat. The fact that I've had to turn to rotten flesh for being the first thing I eat as well is a little annoying. But I guess fair. Um. Now, one thing I do want to try, real quick, since we're stuck here anyway, is apparently it can interact with signs, or at least that's what I was told. So we're going to find out if it actually can. So, um... Hello. I'm going to put that down. Nothing. No, no, wait. Who are you? That sound effect is 
gonna get me every single time. Where did my torch go? Oh, there it is. Gotta say. That did not make sense in my brain for a second. Uh, do I want this either? Day? I know copper is useless, but might as well grab it. I need to type it in there the, the correct way. I don't know. If I push tab, no one else is in the world, so. I don't know what we have to do. I don't know if that video was correct or true at all. For all I know is... This is an ARG mod, so I'm just going off of things people do in ARGs. <sighs> do you put the doors opening sound and not opening the doors? I guess you're trying to confuse me, but also... I feel like it could be so much creepier if you actually open the damn door. I'm sorry, are we going with the ARG trope of mobs for some reason not spawning? Oh no, wait, we got a skeleton over there. Don't see anything over there. Oh, hello, zombie bastard. That's right, take some fall damage, bitch. You were a lifesaver. Carrot. What is that sound? I do not recognize that sound. What the fuck was that? I was just confusing. Yeah, we'll add some copper now. I'd like night to end. Just so that I can not go outside and die. Yes, I can do some scoping things out. But you know what I should do? I should make a bunch more torches and just light up this cave. That would be a smart idea. God fucking damn. Quit with the doors opening. It's creepy, yes, but it also plays too much. But then again, if the tick update thing is just updating ticks, and then it'll occasionally do it, and then there's no real way of easily making it less obtrusive or annoying. As someone who's dealt with tick updates. Of course, I don't think this mod was made using mCreator. Of course, I could I could also be wrong. <laughs> okay, the sun is coming up. I'm going to grab... Some wood. And some stone. I'm going to go outside and I'm going to find some fucking food. I'm going to leave that sign there. Actually, before I go... I should probably remember. Starter Cave. God, I know you guys can't hear it, but my dog just must have woke up and decided to choose violent. Because now he's just scraping the bottom of his cage for some reason. He's supposed to be sleeping, but apparently not. Because it's very late here. Yes, I am playing a horror game at night. I wanted the spook value. Uh, actually, I don't want to go to the jungle biome. I want to go to the forest biome. Screw it. 
God damn. I really am not sure I like this fucking generation now. Jesus Christ. Ugh. Getting down here is just gonna be annoying. For no fucking reason. Fish. 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 Yes, I saw you drowned. Fuck off. I don't care about you, I want the fish. The first easily edible food I've seen other than that carrot. That's about no iron in that cave. Yeah. I can get this fish, please. We're trying to place torches under the water. God, I hate this hill already. Climb. Climb. I have to do the classic fucking parkour bullshit. Oh my god, that's it. Fuck it. I build up. Nerd pole. God damn. Why is it a sure clip? Why am I hearing sounds of doors closing? There's no doors nearby. But yeah, uh, this mod seems to be classic style, so I'm assuming that I have to go to, like, classic biomes for things. I would assume. Or maybe it's just any biome. I'm not sure. But I'm gonna find out. Let's see. Watch there be, like, an entirely different world gen that I'm supposed to have turned on, and I just didn't. Because instructions unclear. I saw a bunch of stuff in the sky, so I can also look up for that. Oh, is that a village I see? Is that a village? Is that a village? Please be a village. Please, yes, be a village. Village? Village. 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 That's a village. That's big. Hell yes, we need food. And hopefully there's iron there, because I, apparently I can't fucking find any. I think I saw some on a cliff face, but I, it's too high up to reach. God, it's so hard to tell where the water starts in this shader. I'm using a complementary unbound for the pre. I honestly do love complementary unbound. It looks great. Doesn't look Minecrafty, but it looks great. Alright. But if you guys want me to continue this and you want me to just turn off the shader, I gladly will because I don't know if it takes away from the fall or not. Frankly, I think shaders kind of add to it because they add that dark effect and make it more shadowy. Dark things are darker than they actually normally are. Oh my god. Fucking climb. Why is everything a sheer cliff here? Fuck your sheer cliff. Get my fucking inventory. God, what is world gen? I hate the world gen here. The world gen is horrible. Alright, let's see what this village is. Hopefully it's something interesting. And not just a normal village. That'd be sick. But it seems to be just a normal village. There's a bed, I'm stealing it. My bed now. Also probably gonna right click on one just to... I was going to say, where's the job block? But no, it's right there. I'm going to right-click on this one, just in case. Ooh, water bucket. Nice. Or bucket, rather. I don't know why I said water bucket. That's what I'm going to use it for. Piss off sound effects. Oh, 
Oh, there's a villager. Why does his head... Why do your head... Oh. Because you're fucking Acacia villager, and I haven't seen Acacia villagers in... Also forever. <laughs> Give me your wheat. I shall have a feast when I get home. I shall feast upon all of your wheat. I don't know how long before creepy stuff starts happening. Again, I am unsure if I have fucked anything up in the setup of this mod. I could have, I could have very easily. It would not have been hard. Interestingly, this thing also uses Gecko Lib, so I'm expecting a very animated entity when we finally get to see it. Who knows, maybe you guys have already seen it and it's just appeared in like my peripherals and I've completely fucking missed it. I would also not be surprised. Uh hmm. There's sweet over here. Give me. Melons. Why the hell I use my fists when I can just use my axe and actually collect them faster? Fun fact, unless they changed it, I'm pretty sure axe is the fastest way to harvest melon? Or was it the hoe now? I don't know, they added a bunch of uses for the hoe recently. I know it's better at harvesting hay bales. Melons. Hello, Gollum. I hope you're not going to attempt to kill me at any point. I would hate that, although I might attempt to kill you. Because it might be the best way for me to get stuff. Hello, cows. I would crit you with an axe, but I don't feel like wasting my axe. When I have a perfectly good sword. Oh, son of a bitch. Come on, skelly bitch. Go out into the sunlight. Are you not in the sun? Or is the sun actually down and I'm just not seeing it yet? Because of the shader. That is actually entirely possible. I should probably hurry the fuck up. Oh no, you just weren't in the sun yet. I didn't realize the thing spread that far. Pull the arrows. They can still damage you just from falling. That is a glitch in Minecraft that they've never fixed, actually. It's kind of annoying. <laughs> well, I guess it's not really a glitch, it's just kind of a weird feature. What the hell? Well, this stonecutter's house just got completely bare. Bread. 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 <laughs> I was gonna say this this house got completely buried, but never mind, it's just hiding bread from me. It was attempting to hide the bread from me. I'm gonna hide the bread from me, my bread. Mine. All you piss off. Don't mind the fact that I just phased through your fucking door. Hello, cow. You're mine. Food. Food. Dude, maybe I should have grabbed all the shit from that old base. I might just live in this village for now. It seems like a good idea. Oh, cartography table, empty maps. Like those. Alright, back to the fucking house thing. Hello, sheep. I would kill you, but I don't need wool. I don't see anything in the sky or anything. The developer of this mod has a habit of putting things that spawn in the sky. Oh, not not yet. Also, really not sure how the hell this mod works, but... I mean, we'll figure it out together. 
there was another portal over there. Kind of want to check it out. Same time, Nightfall. Nightfall sounds like not good. Not fun. No, no, no. Oh, don't mind the fucking sound of my chair. Sorry. Hi, guy. Don't mind me. Just gonna sleep. Thank you, sir, for opening and closing the door for me. <laughs> I have never timed that with a villager, ever. That was actually kind of impressive. Uh, hmm. Alright. We're just gonna make a waypoint here. For first village. Just to make navigating this place easy. Was that a cave sound? That sounded like a normal Minecraft sound. Was that just a was that just a cave sound? I don't remember that cave sound. Alright, so let's see. Anything Anything in these houses? Is that apparently a grass block that is fused with the door? Got so many brewing stands. If I want to brew a potion, I have brewing stands. Just don't have the things to actually brew the damn potion. But I have brewing stands. Okay, I'm thinking we check out this nether portal and then call it because I think I think I'm out of time. Yeah, I'm out of time for this video. <laughs> I don't want to post an entire hour long exploration because I don't think you guys realize how long it takes to post hour-long videos. Like, YouTubers who post those hour-long ones, they have patience. It takes a lot of patience to post those. I have the patience as well, but I also just don't... Wait a minute. No fucking way. Hold on. Are you shitting me? Also, is that the old texture for crying obsidian? What the fuck? Also, I, I just remembered. Fucking netherrack. I forgot this is what it looked like. <laughs> it looks so normal to me because I've always played in that version. Okay. This was a nether portal. There was only one crying obsidian in that corner. Everything always be correct. Missing one block and the block was in the chest. What kind of fucking luck is that? Oh, I pushed F5. One to me What the hell? Okay. Um. I don't have armor, but I'm curious where the hell this lands. I'm just gonna duck in and duck it back out. What the hell? <laughs> I didn't expect another portal right off the bat. That's honestly kind of horrifying. <laughs> God, I didn't expect that. That's sick. It's actually really useful, and oh god, lag. And oh, hello, hell. What the fuck is that effect in there? Is that on the shader? That's sick. I love that. That's so creepy. It looks so cool. God, um... Yeah, oh yeah, also old soul sand. Yay. I like I kinda like the old soul sand because it always has a, it very clearly has screaming faces in it. So yeah, Soul Sand Valley. Very big Soul Sand Valley, actually. Yes, 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 back to the portal, back to the portal, back to the portal. Okay, so we have access to hell. Um in a horror mod. We have direct access to hell. Uh how the hell did I find this spawning perfectly? How in the fuck? I've never done that. And I... Oh, look! It also had an extra piece right here! <laughs> That's... 
Oh my god, that's sick. Oh my god. I will never have that luck ever again. That is, that is the once in a lifetime fucking thing. I don't even... That's like the highlight of the video already. Apart from the, all the sound effects, that is like the most eventful thing that has happened. Kind of annoyingly. But also kind of good because that means this thing's going to build up suspense before doing anything big. I keep I keep looking out there to look expect, expecting to see something. But yeah, um uh, I am going to head back to the village, but I'm going to end this video here. So I hope everyone has enjoyed if you should, if you wish to join the ranks of the SCP Foundation, well, I'm not going to edit that, but uh as you can tell, I fucked up my own outro. <laughs> Fun. <laughs> anyway, I hope everyone has enjoyed. If you should join the ranks of the SCP Foundation, don't forget to shoot that like button, slay those comments, and contain the subscribe button. Anyway, guys, I'll see you in this video, live stream, or the next. Peace, guys.